And the swine piglet. Hello. And we're back with another video, but not any ordinary video. That's right. Today we're doing mm. <laughs> the newest addition to the Bob Baker collection. Do you remember Bob Baker? The man who created K9? Do you remember the K9 show last year? If that you abomination? If you don't, then go watch all those videos right now. Just stop, go watch them all. We're gonna like leave a link in the description and yeah. them. Did you watch them? something? Good. If you didn't, why bother existing? Okay, so now you know all about Bob Baker, I don't want to explain him to you. So you're yeah. sure you are. Okay, so recently, Bob Baker, right in the beginning of January, I think, put out an ad on, on Facebook and on the K9 website. That's right. For this, this new book, K9 Megabytes. As you can see, the K9 on the cover is the same design from the new Bob Baker movie, which has yet to even come out. So yeah. that just adds to the pile of confusion. And the book has no connection to the K9 short. That's literally right. Literally at all. It's nope. Like, it like says in the beginning, like in the prologue, like that he went to like like the K9 show. And Basically, like, it's like said he did the K9 show and then two million years in the two billion years in the future, he's like here now. Yep. And this book makes absolutely no, no sense. No, it doesn't. It's a collection of four stories. They're all very cliche. The first one is just like the starter off with a cliche plot. Like, he yep. can I just like retire and he doesn't want to, but like mm -hmm. people are being controlled. The next one's just the race, like yeah. the pod race. Yeah, pretty much. The third is like the gang war, like the, like the, the bank, bank robbery. Bank robbery. Right? And then the fourth is the stereotype of the fourth story has literally nothing to do with the other three. <laughs> yep. Yeah, it's also the shortest. So the like, uh, characters to read. suck. Unrememberable stories, bland, extremely childish, nothing special about them yeah. at all. Especially our main character here. Our for our main character, Ken Angle, undergoes no character development, is a starky asshole yep. the entire story. He is self obsessed, he is an arrogant biatch, just like his K9 show. Yeah, I don't know if it's supposed to be funny or what, because I don't find it no, funny. No, I don't, or like, or like, oh, I want to be like K9 when I grow up, because like, he's like, I know he can everything fly. cool. Wow, oh. he can fly. Oh, and our copy, all copies actually, for the matter of fact, that are being sold on Bob yeah. Baker's website, are signed by Bob Baker. So now we have Bob Baker's autograph. I'm honored. I like, oh, a big top celebrity autograph right here. Yeah. But still, I'm very lucky that I found this one I did. I was at school showing my friends the Bob Baker website, and then I went- We'll leave a link to that in yeah, the description. Yeah, and I went to the K9 website, and I found this. The K9 website and the Bob Baker website are really both hard to find, are really ancient. They're like, this is probably the first time they've updated yeah. the K9 website in years, and yeah. I have a bookmark. That's the only way I find them. Recently, he did post this thing of Robbie the Robot holding the K9 book, saying, another satisfied megabytes, which is stupid, because yeah. like, yeah. Anywho, now the book is like the, the four stories. Uh, oh, nice human hands. Yeah. Well, there's like the stupid introduction. Yeah, like we said. Like... And then there's the four stories, the gift givers. That I'm sorry, I have to say it in the Bob Baker voice. The gift givers, the nine news race, the time theft, and the proclaimer. Mm. And then the canine tech color. Oh, the illustrations are also hideous. Are hideous. <laughs> they're scary. They're terrifying. They're really, really weird. Like, really. And then weird. they get weirder. They like, get weirder. Look at that. They get the villains really in this weird. also make each villain makes no sense. And the proclaimer, I literally didn't even know what the plot was going on. Yeah, like half these stories, I literally don't even know what's happening. I know. They're also each one has like this like 
female character in them. That's mm. each like each like female characters like so like the uh, little there are seven characters, but they're all like the same, same female template. Like the the young hot chick. Like <laughs> this Bob Baker's like fetish minds. Like he just decided to just put this in his book. And he's like an eighty one year old man. Remember <laughs> that's disgusting. Yeah, that's just the, the, Time Lord guys in this or something. <laughs> then like the last, the last one, well, the last story is literally only like forty pages it's long. It only took me a day to read. It's really bad. The Proclaimer. <laughs> That's him, all right. <laughs> I didn't really know who he was in the story. Like maybe the, I think it was like the prophet or something. I think. Uh, I don't know. I don't even know. It was like uh, impossible. But, okay, so the back of the box, is, yeah, box. the back of the book is really dumb. Again, that hideous canine design from the movie. And then we have the like, movie that never happened. Descriptions it never of each story. The descriptions are really bad. Like yeah. they don't even describe the book at the, or the story at all. And then here's what I don't get. K9 has had a long um, history on television appearances in the BBC television introduction in his own TV series. Yeah. Now we look forward to these stories and begin to set the scene for his future. What is that, what is supposed, that supposed to mean? To what is Bob Baker you're planning? His future. Bob Baker, mind you, is 81 years old and will die soon. He can't try to start an empire now. Who's he gonna leave it to? John Leeson? Oh, we like probably. to make jokes that um he's holding John Leeson captive and forcing him to sign the books. And yeah. that, like, he's just not giving him any food or water, yeah. and he's just signing them, yeah. and he's being held hostage. And it's just, like, follow, um, K9, the official, we got Facebook and Twitter. There is no Twitter K9 page. We've tried to follow it, but... I can't find it. Yeah. So, in the end, this book is abysmal, terrible, makes no I sense. I don't know how it connects to actual K9 or anything. Raises I think boring. he'd, like... It's his canine, like, after he spends time on Gallifrey, but then again, it doesn't, it's not extraordinarily clear. Not... And it makes tiny little connections to Doctor Who here and there, but yeah. not a lot. Yeah, I don't, nobody knows. Anywho, well, the book is horrible, but now that we're done with this segment of the video, we have more crap to tell you about. And this time, it is kind of canine related, but we're going to tell you about a man, and his name is Keegan Joyce. Oh no. So, a little reminder on who Keegan Joyce is. He was one of the people from the Ken I'm Show. One of the actors. One he the played actors. the boy, the or boy. as his street oh. name, oh. they go, oh. Starkey. Uh. That's the first time we've actually said his real name on this channel, so bravo, Piglet, bravo. <laughs> Thank you. Thank Anywho, you. so this guy apparently has done more of his life besides really bad acting in this stupid Bob Baker show. He apparently now makes music, and he's been in a few other TV shows too. And, and he has a website. He has a website, so well, this guy is really Look messed up. So we'll like, see his website. So here's the website. He's selling his one and only Snow album. Snow on higher ground. That is oh, just yeah. Such a dumb name. He has a lot of pictures of himself on this website. I think he's really self obsessed. And then um, he also has a, sh a shop. He is selling crap for really expensive, overpriced stuff. Prices. His cap. Look how much he's selling for a cap. Thirty dollars. And not only that, a plain <laughs> white, white t-shirt. Fifty-five dollars. <laughs> and that's like Keegan's face in the corner. But I'm not paying thirty dollars for that no either. Way. He's really poor or really stupid. Bro, probably both. Then he has just a lot of weird pictures of himself. I don't know why he's oh. so obsessed. Well, you can. There are also websites you can find naked pictures of him. We yeah. did not click on any, no, but they only came they up. They do exist. We and didn't click on any. A thing where you can like look at his acting stuff, but he doesn't say. He just says to go look at other websites. Like, oh, I don't care. Just go look at it yourself. That's our visual thing. <laughs> look at this. Who the fuck is this? That is literally <laughs> what he puts on his website. <laughs> who is gonna? Who puts? Who is crazy enough to put that on your website? Really? People are going to get mad, Keegan. People will find that. What if like some guy wants Keegan in their movie? They come and see that. You ain't gonna get in the movie when they see that. You. Fool. Uh, is that's enough, Frank Keegan? <laughs> yeah, that's yeah, enough. We've had our rant. You hear me? You people hear me? Another thing is coming. You all are going to die soon, just like the dinosaurs. I tell you. Get out of here. Get out of you freak. Get out Get out Get out Get out You all will rule the day. You didn't listen to me. Freak of nature, protester scum? What do they think this is? Protest against the channel day? Well, actually, it is, and it's that day for me every day. What are you doing here, Miss Puff? Yeah, why are you here? I've come here to tell you boys that I still hate your channel and wanted to go. 
Wait, what is that? It's a really bad book, Miss Puff. That's oh. what it is. Maybe it's actually a good thing that you're spreading the knowledge of this bad book. Well, I guess. I hate that woman. One day- Do you hate her more than Keegan Joyce? That's really hard. One day they'll, they'll both be in the ground. And so will I. But, uh, as things go, we don't really know much more about Bob Baker and the canine world and what's happening. Oh. Whenever we look it up, we, every single website says different things. Like, like things about a movie, a, a new television TV show. show. One, like, talk about how, like, pictures were taken on set of, flip, of that witch Jodie Whittaker with crap. And, like... I don't know. Nobody knows what's going on at this point. Every website, every source says something different about what is going on and I what know. is coming. So currently, the future of Canine, Bob Baker, and Keegan Joyce is really unknown to us. And if you know anything, why don't you comment saying so? But nobody's going to watch this video anyway, which makes me sad. Yeah. So, uh, if you liked our video, why don't you subscribe, and if you subscribe to us, we'll subscribe back for you, as long as we're notified, but YouTube doesn't tell us anymore, so you gotta put your name in the comment section, so we can subscribe back to you, like, I subscribe, and we're like, okay, we subscribe back. Yep. So, uh, thanks for watching, and go check out our other k videos at some point, too. Goodbye. Bye. 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 Finding you empty is here